So my take is that uh, it's a budget which gives directionality. Uh, it lays out the roadmap for India to become a $5 trillion economy by 2024. It also introduces some uh, new thoughts in the government, uh, particularly of disinvestment and divestment. Uh, it's for the first time that I heard uh, a finance minister saying that the government can go below for 51% in a central government PSU, as well as they are looking at exiting certain, certain areas, for example, like Air India. So that's a welcome and a fresh thought. Also, the continued thrust on infrastructure, whether it's road, uh, Bharat Mala ports, uh, Sagar Mala through rural road construction, through uh, rural housing development, through urban housing uh, development, low cost. I think these are all welcome steps to help improve the 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 you know the life of its citizens, particularly at the lower end of the spectrum.